हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल बेस्ट जी ट्यूटोरियल एंड टुडे लेक्चर आई वुड लाइक टू शो यू हाउ टू डाउनलोड अर्थक्वेक डेटा एंड यू कैन प्रिपेयर अर्थक्वेक मैप फॉर अ डिफरेंट एरिया सो लेट्स स्टार्ट इट फ्रॉम बिगिनिंग हेयर यू कैन सी दैट आई डाउनलोड अर्थक्वेक डेटा एंड सी फाइल एंड एक्सपोर्ट इट इन टू शिप फाइल After that, I will add a locator map of the study area for which area I download the earthquake data. So now I will show you from beginning that how to download earthquake data for any country or for any region. So let's start it from beginning. So first of all, open the Google, and here you can search USGS earthquake catalog. and here you will see this interface and click on this link now you can see the usgs hazard a quick hazard program now here is the basic information about the earthquake let has is magnitude and here is the date and time and here is the geographic region now if you want to download the data from 2.5 magnitude or you want to download from 4.5 magnitude or you want to download data with a custom magnitude then you can choose with your interest that for which magnitude you want to download the data so let's suppose i select 4.5 magnitude the minimum magnitude of my data will be 4.5 and the above so here you can see the date and time uh, for, if you want to download the data for past 7 days if you want to download the data for past 30 days if you select custom and you will here select the date from which date or from which year you want to need this data so here i just change the date i need the data from 1970 to 2022 and here you can also change the region geographic region for which region you want to download this data if you want to download the whole world data and you can select the whole world if you want to download the conterminous of us so i just select uh, the custom and uh, search my study area location and we choose it i will download the data for my study area so here i will select uh, my study area my country now here click on that click to select the starting corner of the rectangle so we select the rectangle and here you can see that uh, i select uh, this region but i will uh, refix it i will resize my study area to drag this location i just want to uh, customize it and uh, resize the rectangle shape for which uh, area i want to download the data so here you can see that uh, this rectangle cover my country which is pakistan and surrounding area so i want to uh, use this region to download the data so here come to here and click on uh, use the region click on this one now here uh, you can see some uh, advanced option and now here is the geographic information of that region and here you can also uh, see the different event type from here we expand this uh, like earthquake uh, non earthquake uh, accidental exploration or something a building collapses or chemical explosions or chemical explosions so uh, here uh, we will uh, go to the output option uh, output option will give us the information in which format we want to download this data so uh, i want to download this data and uh, csv fine if you want to download the data in kml you can also choose the kml now here uh, check the order by 
Uh, or by mean that uh, if we select the time newest first, uh, the data will be shown from 2022 to 1970. If we uh, select time oldest first, then the data will be shown as uh, from 1970 to 2022. So, we will select uh, the time oldest first. Now, uh, here we will search, click on this search option and here we will get the data and output format as a CSV file. So, search on that. Now, the data here you can see that uh, data is downloading now. After that, uh, we will open this data. Wait for that. Now, here you can see that we download this data from 1970 to 2022. Here is the complete information of the data. Now, here you can uh, study each the column where it is the latitude of the data, longitude and depth of the earthquake and here is the magnitude of the earthquake. Here you can see that. Now, uh, here is the detailed information. Now, I will uh, export this uh, uh, CSV file to a ship file and uh, I will show you how to add this data into GS software. For this, uh, I will first open GS software and go to add data and add XY data and here we will choose Excel sheet, we download data. So, I select this one. Now, here you can see that uh, uh, X field uh, take a latitude, longitude and Y field uh, again latitude and here we will choose the uh, Z value which is uh, we will select the magnitude. So, here we will add the geographic coordinate system to the map. If here is a not add geographic coordinate system then click on edit button and here you can select the geographic coordinate system ok. So, ok in this ok. So, here you can see that the data which we downloaded from USGS earthquake catalog is now shown in GS software. Now, uh, after that uh, we will add a study area map on uh, this uh, um, data that uh, we will uh, check that uh, where our study area occur this map. So, select uh, to the study area map shape file. Let us suppose uh, this is my study area. Uh, I download the data for my or country and for surrounding area. So, here you can see that. Now, go to this data and export this data as a shape file. So, right click on it and go to data and export the data and here uh, select folder for that. Here is the GS data and here is the earthquake data. So, now uh, save this data. Okay. The data will be export as a ship file, as a map layer. Okay. The data now here you can see here is the CSV format and here is the output location which is in ship file. Now uh, remove this data, you have no need to. Mm. So, now I will uh, just uh, open the attribute table of that data. And here you can see the detailed information of the data uh, which we downloaded from Earth catalog, Earthquake catalog. So, now if you want to see the surrounding places of your study area online here, uh, then you can easily edit a base map to um, GS. And here you can see that the surrounding places of your study area. I will show you that how to add a base map. Here click on this data option and here is the base map. Wait for that. At, uh, here yeah, you can see that there are multiple type of base map. Here is the imaginary map, uh, imaginary with the labels, street map, a topographic map. I just uh, select uh, this one, ocean or national, Ge we can also choose that national geography map. Uh, so, I will choose this one to show you how to just uh, uh, add base map to your study area. So, wait for that. Now, here you can see that 
this is the surrounding area with the or uh, study area so here you can uh, get the information about surrounding area which is concerned with your study area map i hope that uh, you will enjoy this tutorial and will learn a lot from this tutorial uh, so if uh, you want to uh, need more tutorial on advanced remote sensing and gs uh, information so then um, subscribe my channel thank you